No fairies. Which means I pretty much have to discover what this guy's weakness is very fast. Uh, it's a giant cloud of fire. That I can't do anything with like that. Can I hookshot you? Yes, I can. Ah, uh, no, you hurt me. You hurt me. You hurt me. You hurt me. Okay, so I have to destroy each fire thing individually. Alright, I can live with that. I can do that. Look at me. Look at me doing that. Look at me doing that. I got the impression that I had to use the hookshot because I got the hookshot in this dungeon and typically the bosses are something that you can kill using the item that you got in this dungeon, just like the last one was the hammer. Ah, run away, run away, run away. Yeah, this boss seems fairly simple at the moment. I imagine it's got a phase two uh, when I've destroyed all the clouds, but for now, for now, seems like a really easy design. Uh, I need to grab a last one. There we go. So can I just like hit you with my sword now? No, can't even hit you with my sword. Ah! Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> uh, can I hit you? With can I? Can I hit you with my sword? Yes. Yes, I can. Stay near the bottom of the screen. Stay. <laughs> Stay near the bottom of the screen. All right, right, right. Bottom of the screen. He can't hurt me on the bottom of the screen. Well, that's uh, a place where he's less likely to hurt me, because... Uh... <laughs> uh... Three hits. Okay. Uh... <laughs> I love the boss design in this game! It's amazing! Uh... Go away, go away, go away! I don't want to deal with you right now! Uh... Uh... <laughs> How many times am I going to have to hit you? Uh... Uh... Is that it? No? Another one? Another one? Okay, well you can only move diagonally, so if I... If I always move horizontally... There we go! <laughs> oh, that was... That was amazing! I love that boss fight! And we got the second crystal! That was... That was fun! I enjoyed that. I enjoyed that a lot. I can see why people love this game now. Yay! I found another girl! Mendez, because of you I can escape from the clutches of the evil monsters. Thank you. The Triforce will grant the wishes of whoever touches it, as long as that person lives. That is why it was hidden in the Golden Land. Only a select few know of its location, but at some point, that knowledge was lost. The person who rediscovered the Golden Land was Ganondorf, the evil thief. Luckily, he couldn't figure out how to return to the Light World. Well, remember that you have magical powers which only the hero can make the most of. There are some other magical warping points, like the one you saw on Death Mountain. By using them, you can go between the two worlds and find the evils hidden in the Dark World. You are the only one who can destroy Ganondorf, the thief. No, Ganon, the evil king of darkness. Do you understand? So, are Ganondorf and Ganon different people? Uh, I got I got the impression that Ganon and Ganondorf was basically like the same word for the same guy, but for, for different games. Like Ganon was like in Zelda One, and Ganondorf like the the. Uh, the, the same boss, but essentially in later games. I don't know. I understand, though. I understand. May the way of the hero lead to the Triforce. Kind of a little bit confused about who Ganon and Ganondorf are. So yeah, that's level two done. Now then, uh, I think... I have a little theory, and if my theory is correct, Dungeon 3 should be the one in the very top right corner. Am I right? No, that's Dungeon 7. Alright. Dungeon 3 is in the Lost Woods. That means I'm going to have to find a way to cross between the dark and the light world inside the actual village or something. <clears throat> so I'm going to make my way through to the village. Because I like because uh, there is uh, something that I've realised in the village. Something that I've realised there is. I can just leave that portal there. Because I'm probably not going to need that portal for a little while. That is probably not something I'm going to need. So I need to find my way back to the village. I think it's just this way. And then up here, 
Oh wait, um, I've got an idea. I have a flute now, so maybe, 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 I can come up here and play my flute. Uh, the guy that was here is gone. So if I play the flute, do the animals come out? Animals! Aminals! Aminals! No. Oh, nothing about that. I also got a very, um, very semi-obvious hint that I meant to play this thing in the middle of the village. Uh, I think that might... And this is just a thought, I think that might be unlocking Dungeon 4. Possibly. But I'd kind of... I don't know. I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go see what it does. I think I'm supposed to play this flute in front of the wind cock thingy. Wind... thing. Where is the wind thing? It should be in the square, right? Where's the square? That's a more pertinent question. Where's the square? There it is. So yeah, if I play the water, if I play the music thing, then that turns into a duck. <laughs> really? Okay. And it's just flying around a little bit, and it's gone. Can I push this now? <laughs> Has it actually just gone? Well, alright. Well, either way, I d that, that wasn't what I came here to do. That wasn't what I came here to do. What I came to do was this. There is a bunch of stuff. Okay, no, that's just for a bomb. <laughs> that looked a whole lot more um, suspicious than it actually was. So somewhere around this village, possibly around this village, possibly in like the woods or something, but somewhere on this side of the world, there must be another path into the dark world so that I can get to dungeon 3. Can I hammer these or anything? No. I reckon it's probably something I'm going to have to use the grapple shot for. Uh, maybe, actually, maybe I can grapple shot across that bridge that didn't exist in the Dark World. Could that be what it's trying to make me think? Uh, I guess that's possible. Uh, I don't see anywhere, like, around the village that there might be possibly a Dark Portal thing hidden. So, is there any... Can I come in here yet? Uh, his name was Blind and he hated bright light a lot. Wasn't that... No, that, that can't have been the guy in the desert, because he's... He's in the desert. <laughs> oh hey, there's a bumble wall here. How did I not notice that? <laughs> and how's no one pointed that out? <laughs> Even more of an important question. Uh, rupee, rupee, rupee. Rupee, rupee, rupee. Is this another infinite rupee place? I don't think so, actually. No, they'll, they'll respawn, but I think only when I go outside. Peace of heart! Oh... How <laughs> did I not spot that last time? <laughs> oh boy. So yeah, I think I'm going to stop playing very shortly. But I don't really want to end it on a note where I don't actually have a clue what I'm doing. Uh, the moment... All I can really think is that the grapple might be used to get across a bridge or something. Run, 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 run. Might be used to get across a bridge or something. Is there anywhere I might want to grapple here? Oh, hey! Have I ever been here? I don't think I ever have been here. Actually, no. I'm pretty sure I haven't been here. Is there anything under these... Ah! 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 You aren't supposed to be in there. Douche. But what I could do is pick up a chicken. Well... I could also hit a chicken, but... Ah. I know that if you do that, you'll just get an army of chickens after you or something, I don't know. I know there was a Zelda game that did that, I can't remember if it was Link's Awakening... Ah! Ah, ah! I would never want to really attack the chickens, you know, I think... I think leaving the chickens in peace is fine. 
I think you should just leave the chickens alone. So there's just a load of random grass around here. Is that all there is? Can I hit this tree? <laughs> that looked weird. Okay, let's uh, do that again. Whee! Oh no, it didn't happen again. Oh yeah, it bounced, uh, it bounced me off that wall. Okay. So we got a cave here. Which doesn't lead anywhere. But, more importantly, if we look up here, we actually have a pa uh, well, a house, for one thing. Let's check out this house. If, I, if my lost partner returns, we can temper your sword, but now I can't do anything for you. Who is your lost partner? Can I steal your hammer? No. Can't steal your hammer. That was the first thing I thought of when I entered that room. Can I steal that hammer over there? That is what I wanted to do. Uh, no, I don't want to use magic. I want to use my hammer. I've already got a hammer, I guess. I don't uh, I don't actually need another hammer. And we can get down here. So is this just for a piece of heart or something? Very possible. I mean, B1. Really? <laughs> I think left will lead me back to the place. But if I go... What the heck is... Is this red potion? Uh, am I meant to use something here? Like... An empty bottle, maybe? No? Maybe I can catch the potion, no? What is this? I have absolutely no idea. Can I charge it? No? Uh, hook, shot, bomb... I'm getting way too many items to be testing every item out on everything now. So I haven't... So no, I'm just gonna give up with that. I don't know what it is. Am I going to find out one day? I don't even know. Maybe I'll find out, maybe I won't. Maybe I will find out, maybe I won't. Yeah, I've never been here before. That's really weird. <laughs> so, yeah, still don't have an idea of where I'm supposed to go. There's nothing under there. But this is a really weird little area. Uh, well, I guess there was no harm in me not finding this place earlier. I totally meant to come here. Hey, what's the, hey, there's a crack wall here. Did I see this before? Is this another of those crack walls I missed? Really? Because that seems... No, wait. I can't destroy this crack wall, can I? I'm sure I must have seen it, but then I was like, I can't do anything with this crack wall. I can't hammer it. Uh, can I use the hook shots to break it? No. Okay. Maybe I need a bulldozer. Maybe I need some kind of bulldozer. Or something, I don't know. Uh, not going to waste time picking those up. I'm pretty sure I've already done it at least, at least once. So yeah, I want to check out this bridge up here. Because if I'm right, there must be some way across the bridge that I can hook shot. But I can't. Oh... I'm, I'm, I'm actually a little bit stuck. I don't actually have a clue how I'm going to get to Dungeon 3. And if I can't get across that bridge, because there's only like two ways across, there's only that way there, and then the other way is down here, but I happen to know for a fact that down here, the only way I can actually get across is uh, with one of those eight things that I actually can't move yet. It's kind of weird. So I don't really know what I'm going to be doing. There must be another place in the light world that lets me teleport back to the dark world somewhere. So I'm going to go search for that. And I shall see you soon. Whoa. Huh? Ah! What? <laughs> oh, whoa! Oh man, I've got, like, teleports around the place. <laughs> That's crazy. So, is there anyone... Uh, 
Um, I'm still searching the Lost Woods. Is there any way to add back out? No. So if I get picked up, then I absolutely have to be told to go somewhere. Okay. Really? That's it. <laughs> There's an arrow and everything pointing that way. Ah, this is this is a clear sign that I should stop playing. It was just like right above the bridge, and I spent the last forty minutes trying to find it. Ah, this is this is a very clear sign I need to stop playing. Well, let's have a let's have a quick little preview. So we got these things over here. We got a thing. Oh, no, we don't have a thing there. Uh, so a bunch of yeah. So I could. No way, I can't go in there because I need the thing to lift the heavy things. Okay. So this is where the graveyard is on the light world. There's lots of balls I might want to destroy around here. So can I kill you? Can I kill you, please, be? You make kind of annoying noise, so I don't really want to be, uh... Ah, <laughs> ah bombs. Oh man, I can't believe it was that easy. I can't believe it was that obvious a place. Uh, that's where the sanctuary place is on uh, the usual light world. Is there anything around here? No. I'm going to try destroying all these blocks around here then. Uh, because I'm just cu kind of curious as to whether there is anything in this graveyard. I don't think there is because it's like the last block, so no. I guess not. Although I can come around here. Uh, is that where I want to go? Oh hey! Actually, this will let me if I if I uh, if I use the mirror now, I can get back to the light world. And I remember that that place had like a grave, but I can't push this grave. That's the only block grave in the whole graveyard that I can't actually push, unless I can push it down or pull it up. No, doesn't seem like it. So that's just a bit weird. It doesn't seem to do anything. <laughs> that's that's just the, uh, okay. I spent a lot of time wondering about that thing. Is there anything if I go back to the light world here? Is this a new place I've not been? Yes, it is. Oh man, what's in here? Uh, just pots. And a bombable wall at the back. I see that bombable wall. You can't hide that thing from me. You can't hide a bombable wall from me. Well, unless you put it in plain sight. If you put it in plain sight, I might have some trouble finding it. So yeah, another piece of heart. Yay! Ah, oh, so we're like, um... Getting a lot of heart containers. <laughs> but yeah, now I have... Now I'm in the, da the uh, dark world in the upper left corner. Which used the grapple as I thought it would. Wait, what? I failed at teleporting to the dark world? <laughs> I didn't know that was possible, but okay. There we go. Now I've got the thing that'll let me, uh. What, let me wander around the top left corner of the dark world. This is where Sanctuary is. Is this something different in the dark world? Uh, well, no, it's kind of like a sanctuary. What are you? They'll tell me a story. Yeah, why does everyone in the dark world freaking need rupees? To tell you the truth, I found incredible beauty inside the pyramid, but someone sealed the door. You can't do anything with a standard bomb, they say. So yeah, that's pretty much. I think that was the like door with the crack in it that we saw. Oh boy. Okay. <laughs> so we need like an upgraded bomb, maybe, or something that will like, let us open uh, more cracked walls. So I'm taking that guy out from a distance because I got my sword lasers, and when I got my sword lasers, I like to use my sword lasers. Sword laser, sword laser. I got a that, that was like an arrow pointing down right. Is that a sign that I want to use this here or something? I honestly can't tell. I don't even think so. No, I think I've pretty much been here. So right, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna um, end this episode here because I'm done. I am done with my exploration. I'm just gonna quickly have a yeah. And we'll save that for next time when I'm in a bit more of an exploring mood. Okay, next time. <laughs>
<laughs> we need to find the way to Dungeon 3, and we need to actually do Dungeon 3, so uh, yeah, that's the plan for next time. See you next time, folks!